you what this moment means to you both? This moment means a lot, you know, representing our country. Um, it's, this is my first game, so it's a big eye-opener for me. And I really, I can't wait to start racing on Thursday. And the ceremony here, what, what sort of, uh, how, how did you react to that? Well, the welcoming ceremony was awesome. I thought it was very welcoming, um, especially the fellas on the uh, jumpy legs. That was awesome. Ahmed, tell, tell me about your, your uh, first, this is your first games too. Tell me how it is to be here and just give me a little bit of your life before this, your early life. Well, just to be here is unbe unbelievable and uh, we've worked so hard to get here. Um, this was my goal since uh, a year before Beijing to get to London and the fact that we are here is just truly really incredible and uh, yeah, I can't stress enough how, hard, how much hard work had to be put to get here and to represent Australia is just absolutely incredible. You can't, we're, there's no words in the, di in the dictionary that could actually explain how we're feeling right now. We're just over the moon to get here. Did you ever dream when you were younger that you could possibly be doing this? No, uh, when I was younger this was definitely not on uh, the plan at all. Uh, it was just um, as life went on it's, uh, and uh, dreams had different dreams and goals that I've developed and yeah along the pathway this was one of them but never initially, no. What's the best part of being here? Well I think being amongst all the other athletes in all the other countries, um, you know just going into a comp pool and mingling with everyone else. And then I, I just can't wait to start racing. <laughs> I've been training for the last five years for this, so it's all come down to the next, well, the next five days is my main event, 1.50 a.m., so I can't wait for that. So the competitive juices are running hot. Oh, Absolutely. They're boiling up inside. I need to let them out. They're just rearing the race right now, so it should be good. Now, you had a, a tough start in life. Compare your life right here, right now, to how you started out. I wouldn't say it was a really tough life. It's just a little bit challenging, and you've just got to go around it a different way. Um, born back in Baghdad, and was just so fortunate to be brought out by my mother Moira to come out here and just brand new life, brand new opportunity. And Australia really embraced me, and uh, yeah, I just couldn't believe how kind and friendly everyone was. And uh, I did get my prosthetic legs, and I was able to walk for the first time like, in a comfortable state. And then uh, be able to run, I made a, a vow that I was going to try and represent Australia and uh, hopefully win gold or do something to pay back for their wonderful kindness. So yeah. Well, very best of luck to both of you. Thank, Thank you, you very, very much. much and thanks for the support. And Cheers. I hope that if you've got any, any medals, they've got a nice golden sheen to them. We'll find Absolutely, out. <laughs> we'll see.